the Sam Bass story with my great-great-grandfather was interesting because a lot of people didn't know that black folks rode with the Sam Bass gang. Well, my great-great-grandfather, according to my great-great-aunt, supposedly rode with him on some escapades and uh, he was a friend of Sam Bass because Sam Bass would come through Birdville quite a few times and he needed a place to rest, he needed a place to change horses, he needed a place to eat and Birdville, the Garden of Eden, was the perfect place. Uh, Sam Bass, when he would ride from Denton, which was 30 miles, going to either Waco, Austin, Round Rock, whatever, he would always stop in Birdville. A lot of times he would go to Dallas, he would go to other places, but he'd always stop at his friend's a Major Cheney's house because it was always something great there to see, to eat, to do, and what have you. Now, I don't know how many escapades Major Cheney rode with uh, Sam Bass, but supposedly the last bank robbery that Sam Bass attempted, Major Cheney was supposedly with him. Uh, this was when Sam Bass was shot, some of his gang members were killed. Uh, Major Cheney, on the other hand, escaped and ran off into the prairie between Round Rock and Austin, Texas. He was uh, captured by some Indians, supposedly, and they tied him up in a uh, buffalo hide, left him out on the prairie to die. And a family, a white family, was traveling north, and they saw this strange-looking uh, hide that was moving and they stopped to investigate and they found out that it was a man inside and it was Major Cheney. And they asked him, hey, what, what are you doing out here? What are you doing here? They said, well, uh, I was captured by some Indians and they sewed me up in this buffalo hide and they left me here to die. He said, where are you going? And they said, we're going to North Tarrant County. He said, well, I got relatives in Tarrant County. Can I hitch a ride? Can I go along? And that's how he got back to Tarrant County.